Good morning YouTube. Welcome to my kitchen again. Today is Sunday. It's 10 to 10 um, on a grey, windy, coolish sort of day. Funny because yesterday it was as warm and sunny as you could ever want. It was just, yesterday was perfect. And I keep thinking that why is spring like this? Spring you would expect to be like a gradual increase in warmth and temperature. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> but guess what? Every year it just isn't. Every year it's inconsistent like this. It goes hot, cold, hot, cold. And yet I still expect it not to be like that. So I think I must be a slow learner. I just always expect it to be different. That's silly, isn't it? Anyway, so it's a bit cool today, and yesterday was amazing. So, it is Sunday morning, and I have brought Pippa and Jaunty on this morning, because I've been neglecting them so much, and it's horrible. I shouldn't do that, but um, I do. Anyway, I'm going to try not to. So, I've got them here, and let me just tell you what they're wearing. John T has got a gorgeous two-piece pale blue set on. The top is long-sleeved. It's got tiny white spots all over it. And it's a, a crossover front. And it does up with a little um, popper. And he's got little nappy cover in the same fabric. It's a, like a jersey knit, like a t-shirt fabric. And it, they fit him perfectly. This set is absolutely wonderful. Pippa has got the same set on but hers is in pink and she has tiny grey spots. So it's exactly the same with the long sleeves and the crossover front and the nappy cover that fits perfectly. Um, yeah, so that's what they're wearing. I don't know the brand. Let me just have a look. It's not a brand I know. It's um, Yahtzee Baby. So I don't know if any of you have heard of that. So that's the brand Yahtzee Baby. And I've put bonnets on them again to match their outfits. So Pippa's got a pink knitted bon bonnet that ties underneath with a sat pink satin bow. And Jaunty has got his blue knitted bonnet on. They're different, um, they're different stitches that they're knitted with, or patterns I should say, um, but they look equally gorgeous. His, his ties with a blue and white gingham ribbon, which perhaps doesn't go with spots, but these days you can mix stripes and spots and zigzags and anything you want, can't you? So that's what my two darlings are wearing. And they've both got their dum-dums in their mouths for a change too. And they're just the Nook dummies. Um, John T's is white with a pale blue handle and a pale blue pattern on it. And Pippa's is the same except in pink. So Oh, also the handle is clear. And it's white with a pale pink um, pattern on it animals or something on there. So that's my babies all ready for today just to come and show you how they look and to remind you and, and me that they exist. They're not forgotten. Definitely not forgotten. But the main purpose of today's video is that I have some happy mail. Amazing. Well I don't know what it is yet. I haven't opened it. I know one thing that's in there. So let's let, I'll just move the camera and we'll get on with it. Okay, we're all set. Here's the box. Now, this is a box of Happy Mail from my darling friend, Kimberly. I have been talking to Kimberly, and I don't know if you remember, but she talked about some fabulous spray bottles that she'd found, and she had a large one and a small one. And so I asked her if it was possible to get me one. We had a bit of discussion whether to go small or large. I decided on the large. Um, and then we had a discussion about what colour. So I decided on white instead of black. And um, that's what she was meant to be sending me. Now, I don't know if you can tell how big this box is. But there's my hand. You can see how big it is. And it's packed to the top. So either it's a giant spray bottle or she's added something else into the box. So let's have a look together. If, oh yes, yeah, she's done the right thing. Brilliant. She's wrapped it in a pink. Can you see that pink? It's a light pink. I think it's probably a tablecloth, but all I know so far is it's light pink plastic, which is always wise. Although, you know, I've noticed that our post doesn't seem to get wet. 
like it's protected in Australia at least. Perhaps it gets wet before it reaches here, but it's pretty good once it gets here. Although sometimes my letters in my letterbox get wet, get wet because my letterbox is a bit leaky. It's a handmade wooden one and it seems to be, you know how wood um, doesn't do all that well in the rain. It's painted, but it's sort of coming apart a bit. I think it's a bit like a lot of things in my house. They're just getting old, a bit like me. Oh, okay, I think this is a bag. Oh my goodness, look at that. That's gorgeous, Kimberly. You get, guys get such good things in your countries. We don't have nice things like this. Let me just start pulling things out, if I can. Although, let me just see. I'm, I feel under a bit of pressure because I actually got this box on Friday. Today is Sunday morning. And, um, but I didn't want to wait any longer and some of my family are coming over very soon but I don't want to rush this so hopefully we'll, uh, there'll be time so I think what I'm doing now is just putting my hand in I think that's the only way I can really do it unless I flip the whole bag up let's try that it's coming, it's coming Oh, is it a bag or is it a tablecloth? I think it's a cloth. Okay, good. Okay, now we can see what there is. Now we can really see. Let me just put that back where you can see everything. So I've sort of managed to uncover it. Oh, wow. Oh, Kimberly, you crazy, crazy, crazy girl. How fantastic. Look at this. It's just spilling out. Wow. Oh, Kimberly. <laughs> Isn't she amazing? This is meant to be just a spray bottle, okay, everyone? So let's see what... She, oh, that's beautiful. That's what I always say. That's what I always think. Be kind. It's a, a pink bandana bib. That's beautiful. And the writing is in a darker pink. And it's circled with roses, embroidered roses in the back. Oh, it's white with different colour butterflies. And I think there might be two of them. Let's see. Oh, I'm going to put this on to Lottie. Definitely Lottie's going to wear one. That's beautiful, two the same. They're gorgeous. Wow, thank you, Kimberly. Now, there's something here, and I think it's some lollies. What does it say? What does that say? For your grands. Oh, excellent. Excellent. Oh, yeah, they're lollipops. See that? Oh, fantastic. Fantastic, because I'll be seeing a lot of them today, because it's another weekend, which means it's another birthday. My um, One of my eight-year-old granddaughters has her birthday today. She had her friend's party yesterday. They did a singing and dancing party um, where they made a, a CD of themselves, so that was pretty cool. And I'm going over there this afternoon after my family who are visiting this morning leave. So, okay, let's keep going. I'll try not to talk too much, but I'm very excited by this parcel. Oh, yum, my favourite. Look at that. This chocolate is so delicious. It's melting in the mouth. I'm sure you all know about this chocolate, Lindor. Milk chocolate truffles. Oh, my mouth's watering just looking at the packet. Kimberly, you are very, 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 very naughty. Extremely naughty. But I think we all know that, don't we? We know how, what a good artist she is and how naughty she is and kind and generous and organised, super organised. Now, do I do this one? Let's do this one. Let's see what's in here. Not the, not the neatest box opening, is it? Because I'm a bit, a bit messy. This might be the spray bottle. What do you think? Let's see. It's in a beautiful bag. Can you see all that glitter? I wonder if you can. I hope you can there. You can see it a little bit. It's a bit glittery. I love things with glitter. And it's a long, narrow bag with stars and flamingos and pineapples and palm trees. Oh, and it's just done a... just dropped itself down. Now this has got... Re oh, wow! This... Oh, Kimberly, you've got to be kidding me! Oh, this, these are my favourite kind of ribbons. Look, everybody. Can you see them? Let me pick out one that you can see easily. It's a good colour that will show. Let me choose this dark green. These are all the colours of the rainbow. Oh, and they're all joined. Oh, okay. Oh, wow, look at that. See those... This ribbon is the kind that's got the little... 
um, decorative edge on them, the little blobs, and there's um, so that's white, light pink, darker pink, red, peachy sort of colour, darker, darker peach, yellow, uh, light sort of green, uh, aqua colour, a green, a darker green, a light blue, a dark blue like a navy, and then a light mauve and a dark mauve. So that is just amazing. Kimberly, oh my goodness, like I'm blown away by this. Because I first saw this type of ribbon a long, long, long time ago. Let me think how long ago. It was in New York when... Let me think. Did we only have two children then or three? I can't remember, but um, it was probably... Well, it was well over 30 years ago. It was probably maybe more like 36 years ago that we were there at that, on that trip. And I first saw this type of ribbon and fell in love with it and bought lots to put into my daughter's hair. She had lovely long hair. Oh, Kimberly, you're an angel. Absolutely amazing. She just listens to everything, doesn't she? Because I have talked about that ribbon, those ribbons once. Oh, and oh, wow. To my twin, these are the beads that, oh, that many send in the... Or organza bags. Oh, I love you twin. Isn't that gorgeous? This is those beautiful smelling beads that I absolutely love that I hear everyone talking about, the, the dreft beads that we can't get here. I did have them once in a, I think it was in a, in my, um, I won a beautiful outfit from Pauline of um, Pauline Holsworth and I sent them on, which I thought was very noble of me, seeing as I love them. I sent them on to Sue Drinkwater in something that I sent her. I think I've got that right around the right way, unless it was the op. Anyway, so look what I've got, a whole container of them. Kimberly, that's just fantastic, absolutely fantastic. I love that, I absolutely love that. Oh my goodness, she's amazing. What an amazing girl. Now, I think I know what this is. This is the spray bottle that weighs next to nothing. And look, she's even added some of that gorgeous ribbon that I love. It's wrapped in orange tissue. Let me undo it because I really want to see this spray bottle. And maybe you do too because we've heard about it from Kimberly. It's going to come in handy. I'm doing very well with, with Gertie and Gertie's hair. I'm getting near the end. Oh, wow. Look at that. Isn't that there's nothing like I imagined it would look. Isn't that beautiful? So you just pump it like that and it's a continuous, small, very fine spray. And there's something in the bottom, I think, and that's some sort of purifier that keeps the water fresh in there so you don't have to change it all the time. Oh, that's brilliant. I just love that. That's absolutely brilliant. It's as light as a feather. So she could have sent that for next to nothing because you know how embarrassed I am. I am about our closeness to Australia and out of Australia. It's diabolical, absolutely diabolical. Now let's see what we've got. Oh, she knows how much I love this paper and we don't have it here. This um, tissue paper that has the patterns on it. So they're beautiful sort of oh, gentle colours. That's a striped one and that one is a sort of a floral one with a mixture of all gentle soft colours. Thank you, Kimberly. I love them. Absolutely love them. Thank you so much. Now, let's see what else she's put. Oh, some more of this paper. She sent me this before. This is also tissue paper. And it comes, as you see, there's a patterned one, say white and hot pink. And then there's a, a plain sheet of hot pink. And there's um, a dark green in a pattern with a white pattern. And dark, plain dark green to go with it. So that's brilliant because that does just wraps things up and that just makes it look so interesting and beautiful, much better than what I have, which is plain boring white tissue paper, which also looks nice, I must admit, but this is fun, especially because, oh, how cute is it, especially because I can't get it here. This is a giant gift bag. Oh my goodness, look at the size of it. See that lady standing there? Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, we don't have anything like that. Isn't that brilliant? It's a very light green. It's made of plastic and it's got beautiful little teddies on it and rocking horses and little birds and balls and 
a little train there. Isn't that sweet? Oh, Kimberly, that's fabulous. I don't know where you guys find all this stuff, but I guess it's readily available where you live. We just, I don't know, we're kind of at the end of the earth, aren't we? And we don't have a lot of variety here. And another one, oh, Kimberly, this is going to be fantastic. Absolutely amazing. So this is the same as the first one. It's a light green with the beautiful animals. Oh, I didn't say bunny, did I? There's a bunny rabbit on there too. See that pink bunny rabbit? Fabulous. Amazing. Kimberly, you're an angel. We call each other twin because we keep having so many similarities in the way that we do things. We just Sometimes she, she explains something in her video and I just write back and say, that's exactly the same for me. And we've done that so many times over the years that now we're twins. Um, we, we're born on different continents, but we're still twins. So let's see. Oh, look, she said, oh, wow, what's, is this another one? Oh, look at that. Isn't that adorable? So this is another giant plastic bag, gift bag it's called, and it's made of white plastic and it's got a pattern of... Um, hearts and spots and little rattles, baby rattles and nappy pins. Isn't that beautiful? In all different colours. Gentle colours too. I feel extremely spoilt and extremely lucky. This is amazing. Just because I needed a, a squirt bottle. Oh, and this is another one. Look at this one. It says make a wish. This is another giant gift bag. So in the picture it comes up to about the lady's waist. She's putting something big inside it. And this one's got candles and it says celebrate, make a wish. And it's in bright colours like red, blue, green and some spots. That's fantastic. Oh my goodness, so that's, that's three I've got. So I can actually, I have a problem sometimes in that when I have something fabulous, I don't want to use it. I know that's crackers, completely crackers. But... Um, now I know I can use one of these, at least one, because I've got a few. Oh, look, here we go. It's another beautiful one. Oh, good. Okay. Excellent. This is another one. This is a dark blue one. It's a giant gift bag as well. And it's got interesting blow-up balloons, so shapes. You know how there are those clever people that can make shapes out of those long, skinny balloons? So there's a swan and a dog and a flower and a birdie. Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you, Kimberly. And it says, Hooray, Paris, celebrate. Some little flags on there too. Oh, I really will use these now. I'll keep, make sure I keep one for myself, just to have, which is a bit strange. It might be the collector in me. And here's another one. This is a completely different one. This has got cutie patootie on it, sweet little... What comes after that? I can't see what comes after sweet little... Maybe just sweet little and then adorable. And yay, a baby. So it's sort of a white background. It's got some colourful spots on it, like confetti almost. And then the writing in kind of orange and pink. And a bit of grey. It's beautiful. Okay, well, I can relax about using those now, can't I, really? Now, I don't think I showed you this because I've only just discovered these beautiful autumn leaves that Kimberly's put in the bag. Oh yeah, there's a ton in the bottom there. And a little organza bag. Zumba. Oh, yummy, beautiful soap. Goat's milk soap, grapefruit. Oh, that's fabulous. And it's in a plastic bag for safekeeping too, inside the organza bag. I can still smell it. It's stunning. Oh, can I smell that again? Oh, I love it. Absolutely love it. Something about soap, isn't there? I only use this old-fashioned soap. I don't use the modern squeezy type things. I love proper soap because it always smells so beautiful. And it's worked for all these years, so I just keep using it. I love it. I wish you guys could smell it. Go, take a deep breath, and I'll bring it up close. <sighs> Can you smell that just a weeny bit? It's the sweetest smell. Oh, I love it. Thank you, Kimberly. Oh, my goodness. Now... A present, a little present in this special ribbon. So I, I would say that my twin Kimberly also has this ribbon at her house. Maybe she has those lovely, exactly the same rainbow um, options that I have. And see, she didn't put sticky tape on there to make it easier for me to open. Although I just would have used the rip method, wouldn't I, to get into it? Let's see what this is. Let's just see what. 
Oh, oh yes, very good. That's a jar key, should be in every kitchen. One easy lift pops the vacuum. Oh wow, so the lid spins free. Oh wow, lid stays undamaged and resealable. That is brilliant. That is brilliant. I'll tell you how I have to open things at the moment. What I do is I put it, I put the jar under hot water, which helps to expand the lid slightly because the lids are always metal. And then I have to lie it on its side on my sink on top of a sponge to hold it steady. Then I get a knife and I put it under the lid and I twist it. And when it goes pop, I know it's open. Occasionally I get stuck and can't open something, so um, this will be a whole heap easier. Whole ton easier. Let's see the back of it. That's brilliant, Kimberly. Brilliant. Revolutionary, yet so simple. No twisting, no straining, just lift and lids spin free. It's so easy. So you just place the jar key on the rim of the lid, lift gently until you hear the vacuum pop and then the lid is now free to spin. Look, see that? How cool is that? I'll definitely be using this. I won't have to do my silly complicated method. That's brilliant, Kimberly. And that just fits easily into my drawer with all my peelers and things. That's perfect. And blue matches my kitchen. You all know I have a blue kitchen. I bet you that's why she chose a blue one because that would be Kimberly all over, wouldn't it? Isn't that fantastic? Wow, can't wait to have a go at that. I just opened a jar of applesauce yesterday because I was having some pork and I absolutely love applesauce. In fact, I think I could live on it, but I don't. I have to control myself because honestly I could eat the biggest jar just in one hit. And I've always been like that. I don't know what it is about applesauce. Oh, look what I found at the very bottom. Oh. Okay, I found the card at the very end, and let me just show you the, I'll put these, um, see if you can see all those, can you see those? No, not quite, there we go, it's a little bit dark the way I'm doing it, but they're the autumn leaves that she's given me, I can use them for my rosy primrose, they look beautiful scattered around her, oh I must show you, I have to dress her up in her new yellow outfit to show you, I'll do that in the next video, I promise. Let me just move some of these things out of the way and we can spread out and have a look at the card and spread out everything. That would be lovely. I must get my ribbons, rescue them from here. And move all of this well out of the way. Okay, so let me see this card. This was on the bottom. It must have fallen to the bottom, I think. Let's see, Suzanne. Once again, we begin where you... Something... End. I have to look at that afterwards. We begin where you. You're probably all shouting it at me, are you, Suzanne? Once again, we begin where you. Hmm, I don't know. End. Anyway, it's got really cute stickers: butterflies, ladybirds, lots of ladybirds in different colours red, green and blue and a green flutter by and a yellow and red flutter by. Let's open the, the envelope. Oh and on the back, look at that, so no baddies can open this before I do. It's got two, two ladybirds stuck on there, a blue one and a green one. So we can tell if it's been tampered with and it hasn't. No baddies got to this before I did. Let's have a look. Kimberly, this is just amazing. You are an amazing girl. I'll spread everything out as soon as we look at the cards. Check that out afterwards, see if I can read it. Oh, this is beautiful. Look at that. It says simply grateful. It's a green card and it's got dark green writing and just beautiful print or font, I think they call it these days. Simply grateful and it's got white leaves in sparkle arkley. See, she knows I love sparkle arkley. That's why she's bought this card. Kimberly is not just a pretty face, let me tell you. She's amazing. Now, I'll just have a... Oh, there's a big long letter in here. So, I'll just briefly show you that. And then I'll read it afterwards. But thank you so much, Kimberly. Now, let me have a little play. Since my family haven't arrived yet. Let me have a play and spread everything out so we can see, because I love doing that. 
so we've got this beautiful stack of gorgeous ribbons aren't they brilliant look at all those colours let me count them 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 16 different colours how incredible and they're all on the, the little round things that you buy ribbons on you know what I mean I don't know how to describe those round things now is that still in the picture almost there we go so we've got those and then we've got my beautiful soap. Just have another sniff of that. There you go. Beautiful goat's milk soap. Oh, it says it's great for fruit, but to me, it just smells deliciously sweet. You know, like floral. Just gorgeous. And then we've got these fantastic gift bags. So we'll put them here. In a nice stack. Two, three... Oh, sure, this is so relaxing, guys. See, I've got enough to really enjoy them. Oh, that's brilliant, Kimberly. Maybe she even knows that about me. I know it's a bit crazy. And then we've got the beautiful tissue paper that I can't get here at all. We've got the green and pink one. And then we've got the stripy one. And we've got the beautiful floral patterned one. With little birds on it as well. Isn't that sweet? Oh, it says new baby, I think. I can just see there the beginnings of the words new baby. Oh, yes, up the top too in purple. Beautiful. Okay, thank you, Kimberly. And then we go on to the naughty things, the beautiful lollipops, which will be perfect for today. And I, they probably won't last past today, but they might. They might last a few more days. And the yummy, beautiful lolly, uh, chocolates. We call these chocolates. We don't call them candies. And um, yum. I want to open that straight away. I think I might have to have one of those with a cup of tea very soon. And then the two bandana bibs that are beautiful. Pale pink. They say be kind. I, I hope that everyone tries that too. It really makes a difference to the world. I really think it does. And then my drift, beautiful drift little beads. Use on any load, even with baby clothes. So there you are. Obviously, I won't be putting it in the wash. I'll be using it to sweeten the, the bags that I send off and my drawers and things here at home and my baby clothes. So that's that. And then the object of this whole box was this. My fantastic continuous spray bottle, so that when I'm I'm doing that my hair on um, on my babies, I can use this and keep keep it organised and neat while I work. And hopefully soon I'll be able to show you my little Gertie, because he is. I think it's only a few more hours, and the hair will be finished. Then I will just do the eyelashes and put the eyes in, um, and then put him together. And I still think he's a boy. The way I'm doing his hair, I think he's a boy. Although, you know, with these babies, they can always be either, can't they? There we are. That's all my beautiful presents from Kimberly, which really only was for the bottle, the spray bottle. But that's just gorgeous. Thank you, Kimberly. You really are a very, very sweet friend, and I appreciate this so much, especially because the postage is absolutely disgusting. It's just... I don't know. I don't think it needs to be that high. I, I feel like it's just a way to, I don't know, make extra, extra profits. But I think postage is one thing that is a government service and we all need it and I don't think that the costs need to be that high. How do we stay connected with the world if we don't have, you know, manageable postage? That's what I always think. But look what Kimberly did for me. It's just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, darling. And the bag is still on the floor, but I'll pick that up. This the sparkle arkley bag. So thank you very much for everything. I don't know how ever I never know how to say thank you enough. It always seems like those two words thank you aren't somehow big enough or expressive enough. But I don't know any other way to say it but this has just made me so happy, made me feel just cared for and so much thought and kindness has gone into this box. It's the best happy mail ever. It's just beautiful. So thank you very much, my dear twin, all the way over on the other side of the world. Um, 
yes, I don't know what else to say. I just think this is wonderful and I hope you've enjoyed watching me open that. And I hope that your weekends are going well because I know I'm ahead of most of you guys. It's only Sunday morning here so you might all be snoring at the moment on Saturday night. You probably are. Anyway, when you see this, I hope you've, you've enjoyed watching it and watching my Pippa and Jaunty just for a short time. I will remember to do little Rosie Primrose and show you her in her yellow outfit because I haven't even tried that on her yet, so I'll make sure to do that in the next video. And um, in the meantime, everyone, before we meet again, please take care and be kind to each other, just like this beautiful bib says. There we are. There we are. So thank you, my darling friend. It means such a lot to me. I can't tell you. It's just beautiful. And um, I'll be very careful if I ever ask you to send me anything again because I don't want you to spoil me so much. It's a lot of work and money for you. And I appreciate it so, so much. And it's a lot more fun than just getting a spray bottle, isn't it, everyone? All right. Thank you very much, darling Kimberly, And everyone, thank you for coming back to watch my video. I'll talk to you all soon. Bye-bye for now.